on your side from today's TMJ4. This is Live at 6. Right now at 6, a veteran's family speaks out after he dies before getting his final wish. 91-year-old Walter Smith was at the airport on his way to Washington on an honor flight. But he never made it. Todd Hicks spoke with his family today and joins us with the story that's new at 6. Todd? Well, Mike and Courtney, World War II vet Walter Smith did, knew he didn't have long. A facing cancer, he told his family he wanted to take the Old Glory honor flight. When he arrived at the airport over the weekend, his family realized it was too late. It was something I, I truly believe kept him going for the last probably couple of months. The hope of this kind of hero's welcome helped keep Walter Smith alive. His dream to take the Old Glory honor flight and to see the World War II Memorial in Washington, D.C. He just felt it was kind of a, a wrap up, if you will, of, of his uh, life and his experiences. Friends were taking Mark's dad to begin what his father called the journey of a lifetime. When they arrived at the airport, they realized it would not come true. And they thought he fell asleep in the car in the back because it was 4.30 in the morning. And they said, okay, it's time to go, let's go. And he was non-responsive. Do you think your father just let go? Uh, yes, I do. I, I think he uh, just decided he didn't have enough wherewithal in him to take the trip. and. I think he decided that uh, he had another trip to make. Mark says his journey may not have been the one his dad expected, but he believes he received the honor he really deserves. Either way, he's being sent off with a lot of honor, and a lot of people thank him for his service. And Mark's family just discovered his dad was awarded two purple hearts for his service, something he never talked about. Services for Walter Smith, by the way, will be held Wednesday. Mike and Courtney. Yeah, he did get oh so close.